Shoes, 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 Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. We're back to being dream home decorators. Exciting times. I've also just been for a little jog. When I say a little jog, I went for a 10 minute jog and I felt like a freaking athlete going, so. I was about to say, good tick for me, good job. Good job, Deli, patting myself on the back. Let's jump into it. Okay, so the last gig we had was an absolute shocker. We didn't get paid anything. Um, our, what do you call it? Our job performance went down. I think it must've been our reputation that went down, which is so not okay. And look at us now, like, Kari is so annoyed. She's like livid. She's like, oh, there's elderberries. Basically, the elderberries are our enemies. Um, it looks like we're actually not that upset about it, but whatever. Is this guy married? Yeah, he is. <sighs> Cause the other thing was we were thinking about maybe doing the marriage thing, but we're not really sure about it. Anyway, the other thing I was thinking about is maybe we should move house. Cause we are earning good money now and we could move into a nicer, and bigger apartment. And then the other thing I was thinking, hold on, let me just pause for a second. In terms of neighborhood action plans, it's open right now. What time is it open until six o'clock? <gasps> Ooh, can we quickly jump down here and vote? I know I'm not meant to cheat, but I don't want to run out of time. Okay, let's vote on action plan because, can you hurry up? Oh, I don't have enough points. That's so upsetting. I wanted to vote for modern development, but you know what? It's already at four votes because we already voted for it. So yay. Okay, how many influence points do I need to vote? I need 10 influence points. So it's gonna shut before I get the, um, the extra influence points, which is such a shame. I thought just like, do we have 10 points now? Did that mean we got to 10? Oh my God, it did! Because <laughs> we introduced ourselves to a new sim. That's awesome. Okay, well, it's got one more vote. The thing is, if we do the modern developments, it's a really good time because these buildings will develop and they'll be gorgeous apartments. So that would be really cool. Anyway, let's just see if we can move house because I mean, I don't mind our little apartment, but it would be nice to have a little bit more space. And I kind of love the idea of living in this neighborhood because there are those changes and we didn't get um, a new neighborhood with this pack. The other thing is with our other apartments, oh, there are apartments over here. So these are 500 a week, right? Oh, this one's 1200 a week, hot damn. Why is that? Oh, cause there's two bedroom, one bathroom. How big are these? They're both one bedroom apartments. Mm. And right now we just have a one bed apartment. So this would give us extra room. Can we just move here? Remaining funds, $14,000. Oh, that's if we bought it furnished already. Well, we'd buy it unfurnished. Oh my gosh, if we get it unfurnished, we will have $2 left, but that's with keeping our furniture. Hmm, what do we wanna do? Well, being the interior designer that we are, we probably wanna restyle the whole place. So I say we just move, buy the essentials, and save money to furnish it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm so excited, I feel like, I'm doing this in real life. This is, you know what? I just love The Sims. I just, I just never get over it. I think it's normal for people to get over it, but I just don't. <laughs> so this is our new bigger apartment and it's so cool because we have a little balcony now. Oh, I love it. Um, so let's just quickly do a couple of things to make it look a little bit more homely. And of course, like I said, we'll make money over time to finish this bad boy, which I think will be a nice, It'll be a nice little, what do you call it? A nice challenge for us is what I'm looking for. Also, how are we feeling about this layout? Hmm. I say we keep the layout as it is because in real life, you know, you probably wouldn't. Actually, I think in the last house we had, I did rearrange on the, all the walls despite it not being realistic. <laughs> anyway, let's just use this beautiful wallpaper from the Deligracy and Little Dicker custom content delicious kitchen pack. Get it? Deli, delicious, love it. Um, you can go to Little Dicker's Patreon to check it out. Let's just go with the light gray. Also, I'm sorry, I keep whacking my mouse down. Uh, do we like the lighter floorboards? 
Hmm. Do I like the light of flow buds? Well, I don't mind them. I'm kind of like into the idea of having these warm long ones. This is the color that I always do, but maybe this would be fun and a little bit different. Let's do that. And then these tiles in the kitchen are kind of fun, but is there something more exciting we could use? Oh my God, these tiles are so pretty. <gasps> I love these. I think these are by the custom content creator Max and they're so pretty. Okay, I quite like this. The only thing is I hate the doors. I also wish these doors were just plain and didn't have these line details on them. They always wanna go that extra mile with the, with the different items in new packs. Like I get it, they want it to look a little bit different, but sometimes I just want simple, simple as best. But hey, you know what, it's fine. Could I have a sliding door into the kitchen? Ooh. Oh, we can't change the sliding door out to the balcony. That's so sad. Let's just use this Monstera arch. This is by Grim Cookies. Okay, and what are the essentials that we need like just for tonight? I mean, and also what is our bedroom gonna be? I feel like this room's bigger. Okay, I think this is the bed we had in the other house. Can't remember what color we had there. Let's just go blue for a change. Actually, no, let's go light blue. So we have a bed to sleep in. We'll also need a toilet. I actually really like this eco one. Ooh, we can you use this new basin. <gasps> oh, actually, Sixum released some really nice new basins. I feel like they didn't really go with this house there. Maybe we can just make a little exception to have just, just a little fancy basin moment. Just let me have my moment, okay? <gasps> This is the oak house shower. Let's get that. Okay, I am slowly using up all of our money like super duper quickly. <laughs> so not slowly at all. And then kitchen wise, all we need is a fridge. Oh my God, 9,000 simoleons, what? No. I mean, we need, I mean, it's like worth investing in a decent fridge, okay? And we should definitely use the little Dicka Delicacy kitchen club. Oh no, we don't have a wood turn that goes with this flooring. Like out of the lighter wood turns. We get an oven and we get a stove top. Let's make them separate just cause we can. Also safety first people, let's just put that on the wall. Is that all we need? Oh, uh, and we could probably do with like a, a little bit of fun. Let's maybe have a little bit of fun with this couch in orange. I love the orange. I mean, we could get this. This is pretty good. Or alternatively, we could get like one of these TV units. Let's just whack a TV on top of this and a rug. Okay, I know, oh, oh, actually there is one more essential and that is some kind of plant. So let's put some plants around the place. I mean, come on you guys, it's 2021. Everybody has plants. Your home is not a home without plants. Should we also have just like a family portrait on the wall that is just of us? <laughs> like, I don't know, is that sad to just have us on there? Maybe it is. We can be like one of those designers who we spend all of our money on like art for our house, but not for anything else that we need like food. <laughs> Actually, no, that's a bit much. Okay, I am totally psyched to be in a new house, even if it is not finished. We have the essentials. We're gonna make this house look absolutely stunning once we make more money. And right now we only have $3,000. So it's a work in progress, you guys, but it's gonna be okay. And then tomorrow we are doing a walk-in closet renovation. Uh. Although the payout isn't that much, but there's a massive client budget. So I feel like we could do something amazing. So long as we don't get like a weird, I don't know, mix of likes and dislikes. It could be really weird. They could be like, I like gnomes or something. And then we have to do like a gnome walk in wardrobe. So hopefully, hopefully it's gonna be something nice. Oh, we don't have a sink. Actually, we have a sink in the other room, so it's all good. Okay, honey, time for bed. And in the morning, we're gonna be in a great mood and we're gonna make the most amazing walk in wardrobe you have ever seen. Okay, it is the next day and we are watching TV to de-stress and, and get all of our fun need up so we can have a wonderful day doing wardrobe makeovers, woohoo! Let's go to work, people. It is time to work. Wow. This might be a tricky one to design for because it's very like unique and 
ornamental. Um, let's just do a friendly introduction. Hi, it's really nice to meet you guys. Okay, don't look so tense, Kari. <laughs> Hi, okay, let's talk about previous projects. So we've done a few things already. Um, we did an amazing uh, activity room transformation, a little bit more traditional looking. We also did, what did we do last time? Oh, we did a kid's like forest bedroom, which was beautiful. Yeah, the, the kid really liked this. It was quite a big budget, but it was amazing. There was like forest everywhere. Would you like something a little bit more whimsical like that? Okay, oh, ooh, what did we just find out? Oh, she likes the color white. Well, that's good. So maybe they're actually wanting more of a, a minimal kind of wardrobe. I mean, that's fine. Um, she also likes painting. Okay, does that mean you like paintings, perhaps? Oh, she does not like drinking. Okay, we will make sure not to put a bar in your wardrobe. That's fine. We weren't gonna do it anyway, but I'm glad you let us know just in case we were. Oh, <gasps> yes! Likes French country decor. This is fantastic. That helps us a lot. Okay, so where is this walk-in wardrobe going to be? I guess we need to knock on the door. Oh, yes, what? Oh, she likes the color black. No, why did you give us a different color? I liked the white idea. Great, so now we're going for black country decor. I mean, we could have accents of black. Blank, blank, and it would probably look really good. Um, this is like a big empty space over here. So I assume it's somewhere upstairs they want this renovation. Holy, this house is weird. Is it deliberately spacious so it gives you room to renovate or is that how the original house was? Okay, so this is the master bedroom. I imagine we could kind of reshuffle it to have a walk-in wardrobe in here or we could do it up. Upstairs, but that'd be weird if you go upstairs for your walk-in wardrobe. Okay, I see, I see what we're working with here. Let me take a before picture. Why is this like shoved in the corner there? This is so weird. We need to fix all of this up. They really need our help. Why is there like two doors to get into the bathroom as well? So this is our before picture. Can we move any further back? Before picture number one, before picture number two. God, we need to do a whole new bedroom. No wonder the, the budget's big. Okay, I only I only take three photos. We are three photo wonder. All right, guys. Well, I will speak to you later. Um, okay, goodbye. Okay, so this is honestly so bizarre. For starters, we don't need this huge bathroom. You know, it's just too big. What we can actually do is make the bathroom a little bit smaller. Let's bring it in like this, kids. We'll make that a little bit smaller. And we could actually, you know, put the bed here and put a walk-in wardrobe over here. What do you guys think? This would make a lot more sense. Also, this house is just so dark. I feel like I can't see a thing in here. Oof, that's better. Also, you don't need this. Okay, so French country decor, what is that? Let's click on that and see. Oh, these little baskets of French country, beautiful. Okay, so I'm already, I've already got some ideas. Like I feel like we could use a really nice screen type of thing. Maybe we should just get out some items that we could potentially use. Oh my God, let's get a chicken in there. Is that a chicken or a rooster? It's a crow. Maybe potentially this couch. <gasps> Bathtub. <laughs> Oh, I do love this. Maybe we could, <gasps> could we actually build out a bay window? I don't know, but I feel like anything's possible. And then of course we also need to keep in mind that we have to actually put a wardrobe in here. Imagine spending all of your money on just a cool walk-in wardrobe and not fixing the rest of your house. <laughs> so what we're actually gonna do here is put some, some windows like this. So we're re, we're recycling the windows that are already on the building. Why won't this go the other way? Why? Don't do this to me. Why would you do this to me? This is ridiculous. Fine. We will recycle one of the windows and put the other windows like this. This is gonna look so good, you guys. Okay, what wallpaper is a French country? This wallpaper? Apparently no floor tiles are. Okay, apparently these doors are French. 
French country. So we could, I feel like this will blend in. So in terms of the actual wardrobe, uh, I feel like we should use the new pieces because there's not really much else you can use for a walk-in wardrobe. So let's just go with the modular pieces and maybe we can do all of this in black. Actually, no, we'll do black accents. So let's, you know, just go to town. Okay, that's a nice, that's a nice start. Okay, then we're just gonna hang some clothes up. They said they really like black, so maybe they just wear black clothes. You know what I'm saying? Like, they just love it. See, this is where we're gonna get our bonus points with the accessories, okay? We have lots of like black boxes up here. It's all beautifully organized. Organizational heaven. Oh wait, no, 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 no. They really like the baskets, don't they? There we go. Shoes, 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 Woo! I feel like we're gonna absolutely smash this one. Like, they're gonna absolutely love it. Maybe we should make this black. Actually, I don't know which one suits this space the best. Maybe this one does. We'll just keep the blue. <gasps> Where's this rooster gonna go? Maybe like some fun flower type things. We should definitely have a full length mirror for sure. We can sit here. Oh, we can do the black. Oh my gosh, we're over budget? Are you kidding me? Okay, let's just get rid of the really expensive painting. God, I thought this budget was invincible. I think I'll actually put the mirror in this corner so we can have room for this. Could make this into a very um, creative little clock slash painting moment. Oh, these are French country as well. Okay, get these sconces in. Okay, one of these chairs in black might just, you know, help seal the deal in this wardrobe. Oh, this is kind of cool. A little box side table. Beautiful, that's cool. Okay, we've still got a little bit of extra money left. Okay, I might just put more of these baskets up the top. I mean, why not? They just really like hens. They just love these cute little statues and like roosters and stuff. Oh my gosh, we are actually really close to the budget. I am so impressed. What a very, very unique um, little walking wardrobe. Oh my gosh, and we also have these that I forgot about. I mean, is there any point of having this? Okay, I was not paid to do up this room, but they get a free chair, okay? It's what they get, because I'm such a generous designer. Okay, time to take some after pictures. I mean, wow, it is, there's no doubt about it. It's a little odd. Um, if we had like, I guess, closet items that were French country as well, it would probably look a little less stark. <laughs> But it's okay, right? We did our best. We've done our best with, with the options that we have. Okay, let's call the clients to the lot. Welcome everybody. Welcome to your house. This is actually a very cool house. And I mean, this renovate, oh, we forgot to put roofing on this wall. Whoops. <laughs> oh dear. Hopefully they just don't look up there. Yeah, keep your eyes closed. <gasps> Oh my gosh, look at the difference, the before and after pictures. I mean, it's definitely less sparse and it fulfills the brief, absolutely. It's got character. And I think that this family has a lot of character too. Okay, welcome everyone. Come in when you're ready. Owner tense, it's hideous from disliking the decor. Kari hates this decor. Oh, is this one of her dislikes? Well, they're gonna love it. It's not about what we like. We've learned that the hard way. Gemma, check this out. I know how much you've wanted a bay window and I've actually built it in. Um, and look, I also have this chair, which is in our feature color of black. This dresser is actually really nice as well. I thought you would like it. Take a seat. I feel like you're feeling a little gloomy today. Like chat with me. Do you want me to, do you want to vent to, vent to me? Thank you for this opportunity, by the way. 
Okay, soon they're gonna have their final verdict. Okay, she's ready for the final verdict. I think we've smashed this. I think Kari's absolutely smashed this. I mean, we've chick Can I speak? Checked all the boxes. She's crying, she's so happy. I think these guys are so happy. I mean, they all look very excited, except for her. Amelia's crying. I think it's happy tears though. What did you think? Oh, she likes it! We made this client cry! Oh, you're so welcome. Oh, she's crying. I never thought I'd have a wardrobe that was so beautiful, thank you! <laughs> okay, she's, she's loving it too. I think this is probably our most successful renovation. And I think if you get their taste and decor as one of their likes or dislikes, you're gonna smash it. 720 simoleons. I'm pretty sure they added like a $120 tip. Yay! Do you reckon we've gone up a level? I wanna see if we can renovate an entire level. That sounds good. That sounds good. Promotion? Promotion, anyone? Promotion? Okay, well, that went nicely. The client seemed to really like the new layout. The keen eye for detail seems to really pay off both in simoleons and reputation. Oh, what? Wasn't our reputation excellent before? <gasps> That's because we got promoted to space manager. Kari has been promoted to space manager. She has also received the following bonus, 485 simoleons and new clothes. She may also find more challenging and constraining interior decorator gigs from clients. Ooh. Vacation not needed. How dare you say I don't need a vacation? What are these new clothes? Okay, well, we haven't unlocked this skirt. Wait, I don't know what I've unlocked. Did I unlock this? Okay, the overalls are the unlockable items. So yay, we got overalls or dung dungarees, dungaroos. I don't know, some people call them that. So yay, that's cute. So it looks like we've, you know, been working. We've been working. Well, anyway, guys, I'm gonna leave this part right here. Uh, let me know if you enjoyed it. And as always, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon. Dag, dag.